In chapter 3, in Escape from His Own Guilt, as well as Boston's Questions, Tsotsi, he runs into the night, and his memories begin to drown him. As he blends into shadows, he spots a desperate, desperate woman who's clutching a shoebox, and she's fleeing in terror. Seeing her fear, as well as hearing her baby's wail, Tsotsi grabs the box and pauses his violent intentions, and he opens it to find an infant who's there crying and alone. So this is the event whereby Tsotsi attempts to rob this woman, to carjack her in a fairly affluent neighborhood, and forces out the car, drives off with the car, and inside is this baby. And Tsotsi doesn't know what to do. You know, does he brutalize, murder this baby, or does he take care of it? Okay. And he is compelled to help. It's his paternal instincts coming through, or at least to hold it. And his violent impulses, they clash with the raw human instinct to protect. Now, this encounter, it breaks Tsotsi's cycle of aggression. And it introduces the innocent child as both a burden and a catalyst for moral awakening. So this baby, this is going to be the change, the turning point in Tsotsi's life, where he shifts from this fairly brutal, aggressive, angry figure into hopefully a more caring one. Let's see.